Okay, I'm uh, just here with Jeremy. I'm going to put the video on because Jeremy just came up with an excellent idea, and I'd like him to tell what what he has, and then I have a comment about it. To have a uh, a friendly app to be used either in an iPod or an or an iPad Touch, where you would have familiar scenes found in the communities, uh, be it like a, a living room scene or a scene from the house and you're able to touch uh, commonly found objects, be it like window or door, knife, and whatever object you touch, the audio file automatically plays that commonly found object. Uh, boy, couch, and then to move the boy onto the couch, and it could say boy on couch, but would make it make a sentence. And make a sentence and start, uh, using, and start using verbs and prepositions. And, uh, just as something that you can touch and hear automatically, because what I find that there's not always somebody there to teach you all the time at it when you need to, but if you had something that you're able to look at stuff in your own house and touch it and hear it, um, would be an excellent learning tool. So anyone out there who uh, is tech savvy enough to create iPod apps, there you go. There's uh, one for it. Don't forget to port it to Android as well. Uh, as Jeremy was talking about that, something that immediately came to my mind is that this would be an excellent exercise to do with your language assistant when you go to the house. Have them do that in the house. They go around just the same exercise we just had. They go around and, and touch a window. Not tell you this is a window. They'll touch it and say the word for it. And you can listen. You may have to, well, we'll try and do cover that with the language assistants to tell them to give you the opportunity to listen, don't pressure you to produce the sounds right away. Um, give you opportunity to listen and duplicate that game that we just played with uh, some objects in the house. And you know, you sort of get to choose what you want to learn or you know, tell them I want to learn things from this room. Watch for high-tech gadgets because they'll probably all have the same name or your young people will say, I don't know what you call that. <laughs> but uh, you know, to do it in an authentic setting, uh, the iPod is fine for practicing, but when you actually have the object there, it just reinforces it so much more. So uh, thanks for sharing that with mm -hmm. me.